retired, I decided that I wanted to be an artist, not just a retired person who dabbles in art. It took a couple of years for me to feel that I actually was an artist, and it, it's such a wonderful feeling. I enjoy it tremendously. When I was 63, I had the opportunity to get my certificate in nature illustration at the Tucson Museum of Art. I learned all the basics, how to draw, what the rules were, and it was the most wonderful thing because then you can go on with confidence. I appreciated that training that I got then. When you're in an illustration program, you're learning watercolor, oil, colored pencil. 30, 40 years ago, you could buy a set of colored pencils and there would be 12 colors. They would most likely be inferior as far as archival goes. The colors wouldn't last. And, and that industry has progressed. Most colored pencil artists are working in realism. It's a great medium to do that. I set up still lifes, take pictures of them, and use those as reference. It's an exciting part of my art, setting up the still lifes and collecting items and putting them in a way that's attractive. Oil is magical, and I can't really tell you why. Some people object to the smells of oil, and I love it. It's mixing color on your canvas that is exciting, and you can see something come alive right in front of your face. And I knew this a couple years after I got into art, that that's what you do when you're an artist. You just don't do the same thing all the time. You go on to more creative projects. I've had several one-man shows, both in Tucson and here in Livermore. The one in Livermore was at the Bath at the um, Bankhead Theater in the Founders Room. And I have a one-man show going on right now at Prudential Realty, downtown Livermore. It has 32 of my colored pencil, oil, and some watercolor. It will be up until January 20th. The prints that you see here are colored pencil originals that have already sold. One sold at the Hagen Museum in Stockton last summer. A series of baskets that are Pomo Indian tribe. This is a colored pencil piece that I did two years ago, and I entered that into the International Colored Pencil Show, which is held once a year. One of the 70 people out of 600 to uh, get into that show. This is um, an oil that I did about a year ago, and it was the first piece that I uh, entered in a show. It was the Spring Show, which is the largest show that Livermore Art Association has each year, and it won Best of Show, and it also uh, hung at City Hall for a month after that.